this is one way to do it. I'm here with my rally class and Alice is my videographer again. Sit. The first thing you need to do is teach your dog to target. Um, I'm using my water bowl because it's more visible. Uh, cottage cheese lid does fine. We're going to hold the dog. Now he knows target. Ready? Get it! Come on! And then call him back to you. Don't let him dilly-dally at the target. If you have to, put him on a flexi. Sit. You're gradually do this until they do it close. Then you're going to be moving the target further and further away. We have a rally course set up here we're working on. Well, I guess I should put a treat on. It helps. You want something they can gobble quickly. Ready? 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 Get it! Come on, Walt, Hurry up. Yes. Now we're going to try it from a little further. Ready? Wait. See it? Cookie, cookie. Now say you would do this. This would be several days worth of work. Get it! Yes! Okay. Now. Okay. Yeah. Come on. You're going to do it. You're going to put the target over the jump. Give them room to land. No, there's nothing there. Come on. Whoa, come on. I'm using the broad jump. Yes, you can use it for this. Uh, we're not worried about bringing the dog back or anything else. All we're doing is teaching the dog to go forward over the jump. So get them so they've got room to get going. You can use any jump. Run with the dog now. Get it! Yes! You're going to do that maybe 25 times until you can send the dog. Come here. Leave it. Come on. Back here. Until you can send the dog to the target without going with it. Ready? Get it! Gradually, you're going to move back. So you're sending them further and further. Come on, leave it. Come on, let's go back here and try. Ready? Come here. This is the sign 10 feet back. So your goal is to go at least 10 feet. Where's your cookie? Get it! You can move forward with them. But try not, again, try not to go past the end of the jump. Well, let's say we're not worried about getting the dog to come back right now. Ready? Let's try one more time. Now, come on. Come on. Now we're going to approach the jump and I'm going to send him. Ready? Uh-uh. Come on. Heel. Over. Get it. And I'm still saying get it and to encourage him to go to the treat. Now the finished picture, gradually you will fade out the target. You can even go to smaller and smaller targets. Come on, let's go. And this will probably, it could take a week, it could take two weeks. Ready? Yo. Over. Ready? Now you can call him back. He does an around finish, around, and then forward. One thing you can do, come on, that will help the dog. You have to send them from 10 feet back, but you don't have to stay back here. You're, then after they're doing that, you're gonna move out to the side and you might wanna go back to the target because now you have to get three feet away as well. You're gonna be full when you get home. So here, here. Start that way. You're going to start here, which is what we did. Then after you get them to 10 feet, you're going to come back close again, and you're going to move out a little bit. So gradually, over, get it. Okay, come on. Gradually, sit. Wait. A bigger dog, you're going to want to put this way out. Gradually, you're going to be three feet out from the 
that jump. Over, get it. All right, let's try one, one finished picture. And again, you're working on sending them over the jump, so don't worry about calling them front. Come on, hurry, hurry. 